I was an itty bitty kid of like 15, 16. Wherever I went, uh, there were guns pointed at me. I mean, AK-47s, you know, assault rifles, the barrels just sticking at me. You know, not just at me, these guns were pointing at me and my mother at me and my brother, at my family, at people I cared about. See, my music is mostly influenced by my history as well. And the music that I created were all about what I saw. When I was a young kid, a lot of crackdowns happened in Dalgate. And it wasn't just humiliating. It was, it was scary. You know, rapes were uh, well documented uh, back in those days. And it would have been sc very scary for my mother because, you know, uh, all alone with a bunch of guys, you know. Hip-hop has always been myself, it has always been my first love. And one of them was that you represent your streets. And I represent the stories that come from my streets. Now here's a song of freedom that is patterned on an elegy Cause slavery is similar to slaying of humanity but I thought that hip-hop could be my next home, you know, where I could find myself, you know, where I could lose myself. Tupac uh, became my mentor musically but intellectually you know Marco X pushed me towards becoming an activist as well you know I'm a fan of Che Guevara I mean I'm not a fan I idolize him I think that there are two parts of me you know one who was ignorant and the other one who you know, just wanted to go all crazy, all guns blazing with hip hop on his back, you know. Lord knows I would never break bread for the traitor. I'm the street, so you know what I made of. Love my game in the alleys or butcher. Wrote my name inside a burn down structure. So the song, The Heart of a Rebel. I wrote that song uh, for every rebel out there um, who had a different story to tell. He cannot even define it, you know, because only a rebel knows what goes on in his heart. My studio got raided just after my first song. And everybody was like, who is this guy? Mom used to tell me sometimes, you know, Zulum Dakota. And they questioned the studio engineers. I saw how the state looked at me differently. By raiding my studio, they cut off my only platform that I had. Shit, man, it's cold. In such a dystopia like Kashmir, you know, you, I guess, I found it normal. Rebels in an alley, resistance in the air We are down for the cause, we done murdered all our fears No more pain, we gave this liberty or this death The wretched of this earth will soon be standing like the rest Let it sink from every corner, it's honor and defiance My people organizing, got my rebels in alliance The poet and the scholar, guerrilla and the former Contributing to the cause, like the essence of a martyr Fighting and resisting till a day will come to pass When the last will be first, and the first will be last we are cursed for oppression, a hurts for the tyrant The voice of resistance will never stay silent We're stronger than before, got the jaw that I feed Mighty waited till the end, ain't no stopping or retreat There will never be submissions or there'll never be defeat We will rise, yes, we will rise in the streets like I don't care if my songs are politically correct or not My concern has always been to highlight the human perspective of this conflict. Bring it on, tyrant. Bring it on, bring it on. I mean Kashmir should be in the in the books, in the history books or whatever for its history and for its beauty. But it recently made to the Guinness World Record uh, as the most militarized zone in the world. Comrades in the commissary living in the cemetery we shall overcome by any means necessary. You know we are not a not an intolerant society you know it's it's the whole concept of sufism you know you coexist we have always given um, importance to freedom and to 
to love. Independent Kashmir could solve so many problems. So I think it would be able to, you know, change the whole dynamics of Southeast Asia. And maybe because of us, there will be less of an animosity between India and Pakistan. <laughs> We're just, uh, you know, just tired of uh, this war, you know, where we wanted it to end. We can make a song that could, you know, uh, you know, in induce brotherhood through our music in, in, in the minds and hearts of people. You know? I got truth for your ears, need to hear my brother. Understand the very reason why we hear my brother. Got our people up in jails, do you care, my brother? When every newborn child is made a slave, my brother. You know, my music is here to remind that, that there are people in Kashmir who are good, you know, who are just like you, who are normal, who want to live a happy, a good life, but who do not want to live it without dignity and honor. While we die, my brother, why you hating on those who cry, my brother? Every sacrifice Christ for the cause, my brother. It's time to unify our thoughts, my brother. That's what I dream, you know, that's what I see where Kashmir should be, you know, with, a, with, a, with no wars, everybody happy. my brother and that fire that will burn down their lies my brother i've seen you stand up to the hate my brother seen the epitaph written on your grave my brother and i hope that we take what you left my brother you should know that i'll follow your every step my brother and i mean every word in the song my brother and i ain't never giving up till i'm gone my brother my name is roshan elahi uh I took the stage name MC Cash. It was just about a rapper from Kashmir uh, to be heard, not as just an individual, but as a kosher, as a Kashmiri, uh, as, a, as a child of conflict, as a child of war. इधर ज़्यादा पब्लिक इलिटरेट इलिटरेट है तो उसके लिए उन लोग को हिप हॉप क्या है वो पहले पता नहीं है मतलब क्या है हिप हॉप ऐसा उन लोगों से रैप ऐसा रैप करता है उन लोगों को सिर्फ रैप बोलेगा तो पहला हनी सिंह आता है यो मैं हूँ अखिलेश सुतार एक एम सी मवाली और मैं रिप्रेजेंट करता हूँ स्वदेशी